Tonight, a generous donation is helping fuel those on the front lines of the pandemic. Yeah, we're talking about something as simple as a cup of coffee. KETV News Watch 7's Waverly Monroe shows us how a father's gift to his daughter turned into a bigger act of kindness. It started with just one cup of coffee and it turned into thousands. My daughter is a nurse uh, out in North Platte, Nebraska. Bill Black wanted to do something special for his daughter. She's really stressed out and I thought, you know, what a neat way to be able to uh, uh, be a blessing to her is to send her a cup of coffee. An idea began brewing for Black. How could he help medical professionals like his daughter stay focused and fueled? He contacted Scooters. How big could something like that get? The Metro-based company donated more than 40,000 cans of cold brew coffee, delivering them to hospitals across Nebraska. That's 24,000 gallons of coffee uh, being donated. How many do we have on there? Suzanne Watson is the emergency department manager at Nebraska Medicine. She says the support is overwhelming. It has been heartwarming and staff have been incredibly grateful. She says every day in this pandemic brings something different. We have to be very resilient and very flexible. Black says every little bit helps those fighting to keep our community healthy. And they're just like our frontline troops. They're out there working every day. They're stressed out. They're tired. Uh, they have no idea what's going to happen. And they've got to make life and dis death decisions. Scooters made deliveries from Omaha all the way to North Platte. Reporting in Omaha, I'm Waverly Monroe for KETV Newswatch 7.